I learned this from a former teammate of mine, Adam Lowen, actually a former Reno ace. We cover it in kosher salt, let it sit. These are thick steaks, you can let it sit for an hour, hour and 15. The key is to wash the salt off with hot water. So every time I do this in front of somebody for the first time, they're like, what are you doing to the meat? And I'm like, I'm curing it. I've only grilled one steak, I think, since I've been here. A little bit of fresh ground pepper. We got the steaks washed, sprinkled with pepper, We're ready to throw them on the grill. Travis, the grill is hot, the floor is yours. The grill is hot. We got uh, three ribeyes here. We want to get it as hot as we can to get a good sear on these. Stop watching the phone, always crucial. Time and temperature, give it a minute, and then we're gonna flip it, and then, right. we'll, then we'll get to cooking. All right, so while we have a minute, uh, your Twitter handle is Lunchbox Hero, so why? You just love to eat, let's just tell me the history of that. Yeah, the nickname Lunchbox started in high school, a couple of legendary nights eating, one particular night at Taco Bell, I think I took down $35 with the Taco Bell. The boys on the team started calling me Lunchbox, and it's just kind of evolved into a cooking, eating, just, kind of my social media presence. It's something where I became a little bit of a snob as I got older, uh, and now I, I try and stick to the best of the best. We're gonna go quarter turn and a flip. It's gonna give us a good X. Here in Reno, I think the best one I had was, I uh, had a really good ribeye at Ruth Chris. Had one of the guys take me out that's making a lot of money this year, so was able to get a free steak out of it. One of those things, I just enjoy cooking for people, the people I love, the people I care about, having them over at the house, and nothing better than a good piece of meat. I like my steaks medium rare. I don't know about you guys. Anything more than that to me is disappointing. We have to be careful what we say about those who don't order their steak medium rare. Or below. Yeah. Hey, you know, whatever whatever gets you going, that's that's fine. There's a lot of people out there who would say that's a good way to ruin a good piece of meat, though. Got a nice sear on the outside. You can see the brown. This is cooking at a pretty high temperature. Hoping for that nice red to pink in the middle. see we got the nice red pink with the brown sear on the outside so for me this is that's just about perfect all right here it is my first Snyder steak I'm excited cheers bro. cheers buddy I don't want it to end we got a lot more over there we'll be all right like butter Travis, thanks so much for this. Man. You bet, man. Thanks All for right, having me. Appreciate you.